Stakeholders at the COVID-19 Communication Center say they are hard at work to make sure truck drivers are treated with fairness and monitored to avoid possible transmission of COVID-19 in case of an infection. We should not create stigma on our truck drivers. I was monitoring a group which is many of the Oshwambo speaking drivers. They created a group and really the, the expression in that group is so bad because they feel that people, they look at them as enemies. We must not have that stigma among our people. We must treat them as essential people that are taking goods in this country. We must look together as a nation, all, public, everybody. It's not only the police that need to do policing. It's us as, as, as the public, it's, it's Department of Health, it's the traffic, it's police. Everybody needs to help do this policing uh, so that we see who's the guilty parties and we must act against these people. Tracking of truck drivers and routes has also been worked out to make sure no community transmissions are done in a case of a possible infection from a truck driver. Recently, the Ministry of Works, together with the Walsh Bay Corridor Group and the TKC, we have identified areas where they are supposed to be stopping. Because in the past, it, they used to stop anywhere on the route. And we have identified a lot of problems when they stop unnecessarily. But we have now planned and made a route such that when they travel, they need to stop in certain areas for them to be able to reach their destination without affecting or without having contact with our citizens. Callers during the discussion encouraged stakeholders to assess the situation on the ground experienced by truck drivers and work out modalities that would benefit all. Selima Henok, NBC News, Ventuk.